health workers in hospitals have been subject to routine targeted attacks. As a result, many organizations have removed their names and emblems from project sites and vehicles. Our project aims to improve awareness of these Red Cross buildings, work and vehicles, which may have their emblems hidden to militaries and peacekeeping coalitions. So my team has chosen to address the problem of the protective power of the Red Cross Crescent and Crystal being reduced for a number of reasons. We've chosen to solve some issues which have occurred during conflict. These include a loss of trust in the symbol due to intentional misuse by non-Red Cross personnel. Our project aims to monitor the effects of climate change on Indigenous communities regarding their health, heritage and lifestyle values in order to sustain and preserve their culture whilst also bringing awareness to climate change and the community group themselves. And um, the reason we're doing this is there is a, uh, an abundance or a lack thereof of effective monitoring solutions. And what's happening is it's blurring our vision and our understanding of um, you know, how the environment is, is impacting them. So our team proposes the equipment of soldiers with AR eyeglasses that display virtual Red Cross, Red Crescent emblems above Red Cross facilities, workers and vehicles. Soldiers will be able to see information about the location, its proximity and potentially supplies needed, allowing them to better protect Red Cross workers. Our solution to these issues is a mobile application which anyone can download. A civilian or militant can log into the app to see map with a map with markers that indicate where Red Cross stations are around you. Official Red Cross staff will create these markers and therefore they can be relied upon. You can select a marker to reveal information and information page about the site. We expect that having information about these kinds of resources and what is available at these Red Cross locations and what is not will increase user activity in the app, allowing us to push them information about the Red Cross's mission, therefore increasing familiarity and trust with it. Our solution is to create a mobile application that allows individuals to make entries related to the specific climate change implication that they have observed, and then also to comment on the effects they believe that this implication can have on their community, their cultural heritage and the environment around them. To promote engagement, we propose to implement a reward system. The, re the rewards will be linked to local Indigenous businesses promoting cultural awareness. Working with um, these kind of important organisations really brings um, the emphasis on um, what kind of problems we can solve today and that we really make a difference. The benefit of working with a real problem, with uh, a real mentor, um, Mahendra in, in our case, um, is like you get actual feedback and it's a lot more, um, I suppose, uh, confidence building this project has given me the opportunity to make a valuable contribution to a project that I am genuinely interested in and a project which I know has the potential to improve the lives of everyday Australians and also the world at a greater capacity. It's more personal to us than just, you know, I'm um, getting a preset scenario from a textbook um, like Vincent has said earlier. Um, and because it's so personal to us and because we can actually relate to it, um, it allows us to, you know, have a a more personal connection allows us to really you know get the creative juices flowing so we can make the best projects possible.